Sunday was spent honoring the sacrifices of those who have served our country nationwide and locally. We thank our veterans. In more than 200 locations across the country, the names of fallen soldiers were read during Veterans Day ceremonies. In Lansing, Iraq War veteran Eric Calley organized a reading at the American Legion Post. Reading the names like this, it makes people realize uh, that you can't take freedom for granted. Um, I've paid a, a dear price for people to have freedom here in this country, and, and uh, men throughout the, our, our great nation have, have paid the ultimate price. Um, you know, as I said, 1.2 million names are recorded. You know, there's far, far more than that that uh, fell uh, to try to keep freedom free. At the memorial, two people read off hundreds of names. Names were also read at other mid-Michigan locations, including Eaton Rapids, Williamston, Charlotte, and Owasso. The fifth annual Veterans Day Parade in Ingham County was held in Mason this afternoon. The parade began at Rainier Park and went around the courthouse. Over 70 veterans from World War II to the present participated in the parade. Color guards, bands, historic military vehicles, and artifacts were also on display.